In the previous video of evolution series, we discussed about the natural selection. If you want to watch that video first, the link is in the description. Now in this video, we'll be discussing about the concept of natural selection through an example of black peppered moth. It's one of the classical examples to demonstrate the concept of natural selection. We know in the early 19th century, we had abundance of light colored moths in England, which used to camouflage on light colored tree trunks thus giving them edge to evade the predators. But then came the Industrial Revolution, which changed all the scenario including the environment of England. We had now carbons in the air and many more pollutants that formed the suit and got deposited on these tree trunks. So from Industrial Revolution, the tree trunks got also affected. The bark of tree trunks from light color changed into dark color. Now from this event, the camouflage by white peppered moth is almost lost. And with this predators easily hunted down the white peppered moths. But here comes the twist. At that time around 1848, the new population of moths have started to flourish in the environment. What we call as black peppered moths. And these moths are now taking advantage of black color tree trunks where they camouflaged themselves to evade the predators. By the end of 1895, we had frequency of almost 95% black peppered moths. And this frequency data calculations was done by JBS Heldan through his calculations using general selection model to determine the frequency of black peppered moths during the industrial revolution. Now let's see what's the molecular mechanism of melanism in these moths, what's called the industrial melanism. The recent development in concept of natural selection through this black peppered moth example is one of the mutations that has mediated the wing patterns in the moths. The mutation in peppered moth that has led to black peppered moth is caused by the transposable element or you can say the jumping genes. And this jumping gene alters the cortex gene. When a large piece of DNA sequence enters the cortex gene sequence, that ultimately leads to development of dark colored peppered moths. So the carbon area mutation was in fact a jumping piece of DNA called the transposon, which had inserted itself into a gene called cortex. And then after selection pressure comes into exist, as mutations that give advantage are selected for, and mutations that give disadvantage are selected against. And here, during the Industrial Revolution, the black pepper moths were selected, since they had advantage in their survival, whereas light colored moths were eliminated gradually, as their survival rate diminished in the polluted environment. Now let's get to the variations. We have black and white peppered moths. The black one has more fitness than the white ones, in that scenario during Industrial Revolution. Keep this thing in mind. So it's obvious the black ones will have more survival and reproduction rates than the white ones which had less survival rates and reproduction. And this concludes the concept of natural selection through the classical example of black peppered moths. I hope you like the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Do consider supporting my work on Patreon or YouTube and also make sure to subscribe to this channel. Thanks.